Well, the head of intelligence unit at the Code of Conduct Bureau, Mr. Samuel Madujemu, has admitted at the Code of Conduct Tribunal that he visited the Lagos properties of Senator Bukola Saraki, who is standing trial for allegations of false declaration of assets and money laundering, along with other investigators to investigate assets of the President of Senate, Bukola Saraki, after he gave evidence that he has completed investigation. The witness, who had earlier evaded questions as to whether he visited number 15A and 15B McDonald Street, Ikori, Lagos, after his initial examination in chief, eventually admitted that he visited the property in February 2017. Defense counsel says he was testing the witness's memory as well as credibility as a witness of truth. Every time this case suffers severe damage from cross-examination, they come with a new line. You could see today that all this while, when they claimed that they had inspected, verified the properties and so on, and that uh, he made um, false declarations. Now you can see the witness admitting that he was wrong. The affidavit that they swore to, which enabled these charges to be filed, many of the items they were wrong. You can see them admitting it. The case is falling to pieces. When you are unduly critical about a witness, you are calling a witness lie, liar. You are, you are, you are casting aspersion on the integrity of the of the of the witness. It's for the judge to do that. It's not for lawyers. So the witness must be respected. So our by our calling, we are to respect. Uh, litigant and witnesses so and it is my duty to protect that witness it's my witness so i'm protecting the witness in the course of my objection every objection i raise they are not frivolous they are objections that are i'm supposed to reach to show that the line of cross-examination is not in line with the law